Hello everyone, I'm meteorologist Jennifer Stanonis. With your forecast, we are expecting still very warm temperatures on Wednesday. Temperatures highs will even waking up. Low temperatures in the low 60s, very warm air mass still in place. So highs will actually be probably peaking with this heat on Wednesday. So highs expected to be in those mid 80s, even some mid to upper 80s for some spots, especially well inland. So expect the heat to continue for at least one more day. Uh, areas south as well are going to be soaking up the sunshine and those 80s. So Buffalo high temperatures right on into the weekend will keep the 80s around for at least two more days or two days to be exact. Mid 80s expected near record heat for Wednesday. Thursday will still keep those low 80s, uh, but then we're going to be dropping. Watch boom down to those 60s back to seasonable temperatures for Friday with some rain, uh, but then we drop even more for the weekend. Notice highs about 10 degrees even below average mid to low 50s by the time we get to Sunday. So drastic shift basically going to be dropping by more than 30 degrees from Wednesday to Sunday, feeling like July Wednesday, feeling like early November on Sunday. So uh, you might have to just adjust plans accordingly for the weekend because of the very cool conditions, but also rain. We're expecting rounds of rain. More on that in a moment. We have this ridge of high pressure continuing to bring us uh, beautiful weather for the next couple days. Midsummer heat and sunshine, but then that high will continue to shift eastward, allowing for this cold front to come in. That'll bring this uh, trough of low pressure too, which is going to bring us the rainfall as well, along with the cooler air. So that's what we're going to be watching as we head into the end of the week and into the weekend. So enjoy Wednesday and Thursday while we have them and even more comfortable Thursday, sunny skies. Clouds will start to increase on Thursday. The rain comes in later Thursday night, Friday, expecting rain showers, especially for the first half of the day is what it looks like at this point. And I'll show you a future look in a moment. Those highs in the upper 60s and then as you saw, they'll be dropping down to the 50s for those highs. Basically, our high, our low temperatures are becoming our highs for the weekend. And I'll show you more on that in a moment. Satellite and radar shot. All right, so we're basically talking about this high pressure system continuing to build overhead, shifting eastward for the next couple days. But then finally, a cold front, at least the first cold front that's going to be moving in for Friday will bring us some rain uh, in time for the morning commute Friday morning. Future look showing closer look. We'll have the sunshine for Wednesday. Mostly sunny skies. In fact, waking up to that Thursday morning as you head out the door. We'll have clouds increasing during the day. Rain expected to hold off even during the evening hours, as you can see here on future look. Uh, but then finally, those showers will come in by late overnight, very early Friday morning, and we'll see those showers extending uh, basically from south to north. We'll have wet roads for that morning commute on Friday. We'll continue to have the rain right through lunchtime is how it's timing out right now. Closer look at Buffalo northward. So again, rain holding off until overnight, and then we'll see those showers moving through to include Erie, Niagara counties, Orleans, Genesee, and uh, basically Friday morning commute on for Buffalo. We will have the rain moving through is how it's timing out. Although the rain expected, even though it'll probably last through about the noon hour, We'll shift out of here right now. We will have a little dry break at least for Friday afternoon, although these temperatures will continue to drop. So tonight's forecast, mostly clear, quiet, low temperatures, pretty warm in those low 60s. We're running about just over 10 degrees above average with our low temperatures as well, and especially our highs on Wednesday, mid 80s, running about 20 degrees above average, and even close to that daily record high of 87 set back in 1951. So. We'll be monitoring conditions and we are expected again to have the the greatest heat moving through on Wednesday out of this little warm stretch that we're uh, enjoying. Mainly clear skies for Wednesday night lows, mid to upper 60s even. Then we're comfortable of highs in those low 80s on Thursday. We'll start out with mostly sunny skies, partly sunny with those clouds increasing as we progress through the day. And then rain finally arrives late Thursday night and into Friday. The weekend we will have rain showers locally, but for those of you lucky enough to go to the Bills game in London Sunday morning, well, high pressure is actually building over Western Europe. So that's actually setting up beautiful conditions for the Sunday morning game in London for Bills as that high pressure will continue to push the rain north of London. So beautiful there, not so much here. We're going to be dealing with the rain and also much cooler air coming in. As you can see in that seven day, we'll have uh, we'll ending this nice stretch of weather basically Friday and then that weather pattern changing quite a bit with rain expected right through the weekend, the long holiday weekend through the beginning of next week, potentially with those temperatures highs in the mid to even some lower 50s expected.